me as one of the writers would like to work with on Avengers because he'd been he'd been offered the job writing and drawing the book and he felt like he was you know 10 15 years out of date on the Marvel Universe and he he didn't have the time to do the research it would take to know what was going on to do a book as you know as 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 big character focused as the Avengers um so uh, I was figuring out a lot of the stories with the editor, Tom Brevoort, but I was giving George plots, but the way I do plots is I break them down into panels because that's how I can figure out how not to ask for too much. Um, so, you know, every paragraph of my plot is in my mind, a different panel and I'll make sure, you know, back then, I was trying to do six panels a page or less, you know, on a, on a, on a page that's got a lot of action, you know, three, four panels, maybe five. Um, and I would send this stuff off to George. And in my mind, because I was thinking, you know, classic comic storytelling, how much can you get on a page? What I was seeing in my mind was basically the Avengers as drawn by John Buscema. You mm -hmm. know, exciting, straightforward storytelling. And then the FedEx package would arrive. And holy cow, you know, it was the, the George Perez part. You know, I wasn't writing George Perez comics. George was doing all of that. You know, by the time we were done, it was George Perez comics. <laughs>